hi. Um, I'm just telling myself, just turn the camera on, Anthony. You can do this. This is what you do. This is what you have done. And this is what you can do, okay? Get that imposter syndrome out of the way. And hello, everybody, because I'm here. Um, and welcome, because I guess what's been very interesting is the fact that I haven't been on YouTube in a long time, so there's definitely an audience of my China and America adventures. But, you know, recently I had a big Disney trip with the legend that is Sam for God, and I know for a fact that you guys loved those vlogs. It was insane, so I know that this whole new Disney audience has come through, which is absolutely brilliant, but, you know, I always say that one of the things is I always chop and change and try a few things. I try that, I try this, I try this, but ultimately I kind of realise that the only thing I can do is just be me. And that's what I just wanted to bring and do to this channel. And it's been so long since I've spoke, but I can do this, I can do this. Um, but yeah, it's been an adventure, hasn't it? And those vlogs from Sam for God, if you want to watch, I'll put them in the links below, um, where me and Sam went to Disneyland Paris and had the best time. It was just so thrilling. And Sam for God is an absolute Disney legend. If you do not know who she is, she does all things Disney, Disneyland, Disney World. And I mean, I have grown up with a big fan for Disney, but um, I definitely felt like an absolute ultimate Disney adult over the past few weeks and I've had some absolutely wonderful comments and messages from people on my Instagram and it's just been a bit of a whirlwind and I just felt like it's maybe time just to give you a little bit of insight to my world um, from my perspective because I know obviously Sam did her thing and I was just the one in the background being like hi everyone <laughs> which you know at the time I was a bit like I don't know how it's gonna come across because I'm a bit of a clown I will tell you that so um hey this is my humble abode of just my sort of living room kitchen vibe going on it's where you know things happen and friends and parties and it's just a lovely lovely space if you don't know i have a lot of travel videos on here and i really love traveling but ultimately i am in the uk i'm in newcastle um and i have a full-time job and i am teaching training and i teach adults now because before i was teaching kids and children and that was great you know to build up to where i am now and i've worked with some business brands and um, I can't really tell you exactly who I work for now but all I can say is that I absolutely love what I do um, and as I said I just talk all day so why don't I just bring that element of me here. I'm 31 and by myself and this just is nice to feel like there's people out there. Padam padam we're here. Hi folks. Um, I've been decorating and here is the recent feature wall which if you go on my Instagram you'll be able to see how I did this. I'm very very proud of how it came out. I'm very very pleased I have to say and I think it looks like quite a nice little backdrop here. Anyways that's uh, by the by. Um, I haven't finished and I thought we would do a little bit more decorating so you can watch me do some of this but up there. It is so hot, but we're gonna keep on going. Okay, so I think that's the pattern we're going with. Um, if anybody is interested to know, this is frog tape, and I got this from Wix, but you can get it from Amazon as well. There is two different sizes. There's a smaller one and there's a bigger one, but there's also different colors for different types of material as well. Um, so yeah, about six pound, I think I paid in Wix for this. So it's not too bad. Um, and yeah, that's what it's called, frog tape. So that's how you do it. Okay, get the light the right way, but here we are now. This will need some touch-ups, and also you might be thinking, well, that was yellow, What? where's the yellow? Well, the yellow will be the curtains, so we'll do a grand reveal a little bit later. Um, I will need to do some touch-ups on that, um, and some of the peen some of the tape, sorry, when you peel it, you kind of have to peel it very close to the edge. Um, 
instead of like just pulling it down you kind of have to go along with it um but sometimes it can't be helped you get some loose bits look if you look at there can you see i can see that that bit hanging down from the corner of the triangle um and all i'll do is i will get some more frog tape stick it back down and then go over it again and that'll tidy everything up and then just any sort of little gaps i'll just go over again um so yeah great um and i think this thing actually what i learned is it's actually quite an easy thing to do it's just time consuming you just have to ultimately get the frog tape get everything prepped everything prepared frog tape paint peel and peel off straight away do not wait to peel off because if you wait to peel off then the whole thing will just come off with the tape um but all of those a few little bits they are easily touched up um but yeah hope you enjoyed that for now there is a lot more to do with this room which is why there's stuff everywhere um so you can see here we've got a very black with a bit of color we've got very blank canvas going on over here and then now we have something completely new um, but I've painted this black because I wanted these wooden panels here to really stand out I kind of wanted the black to make that pop and then I was like no I need to carry this round it wasn't planned to do this but there we go um, I will keep you updated so late last night I put the curtains up and I'm going to show you and I am a bit worried that they're going to fall down because um, I don't know if they're up properly but we will um, fix that at a later stage. For now, let's have a little look at the finished result. <laughs> really pleased how it's turned out you might have already seen i just made a start on the next bit we will reveal as we go on but yeah i just need to get a rug i think for here so maybe a dunelm trip and the battery died in the last clip so it's the next day and as you can see that section is done so that means that i can start slowly but surely moving on to the next section and i'm kind of in a process of Life is a work in progress and there is no immediate rush to get it all got it out and completed. It's just with the flat, it's a very much a case of it's kind of hard to move things around. So uh, we should do it bit by bit. Um, but the storm, it seems to be starting. The rain has been flying down and it's been obs obviously, I say obviously, it just depends on when you're watching it, but it's been very, very hot the past few days, which has been lovely. I think it's what we've needed, if I'm being honest. And it's Father's Day, um, and we have been out for food. We also had a barbecue the other day. Was that yesterday? I think it was yesterday. I see the days are flying. Uh, say, sorry, flying. They are flying, but they're merging into one. But uh, yeah, it's Father's Day, and my dad's amazing that DIY, and he built these. Um, there's one on this side, and there's one on the other side there. And I mean, so talented. Um, and I really hope to learn some more stuff from him so that I can then maybe one day be able to confidently do something like this. You can see I've got some cupboards there and stuff. Oh, I also want to talk about Black Mirror. I started watching the new season of Black Mirror, watched the first two episodes. The first episode, fantastic. The second episode, my gosh, I was completely jaw on the floor. I highly recommend you watch it. It's very dark, the second episode, but watch it, watch it, watch it, watch it. Um, and that's all I wanna say on that section. So here's like a little bracket section. So guys, I am gonna leave it there for now and just say that this is a work in progress and we will continue. It is Sunday, so I think it's a perfect time to just end and then pick things back up from the Monday. Um, please subscribe and follow if you aren't already and let's just start some adventures and again this is a chance to give you some content for you to just fill in 10-15 minutes of your day. You know sometimes it's nice just to put something like that on as much as it's just me waffling on about life. Let's hope that I can bring something um, and whatever that thing might be please let me know because then I can hopefully make more of it. For now, I'm going to slowly but surely just say goodbye for now. It's not a uh, goodbye, of course it's not. You will be able to see more and we will continue this story as we journey through life. Gosh, that sounds cringe, doesn't it? But <laughs> anyways, I'm going to stop before we get into bad territory and dad jokes and things like that. Have a lovely evening, morning, afternoon, whatever you 
day of oh god see it's going wrong whatever day it is whatever time of day it is that's what i'm gonna say have a lovely time <laughs> speak later bye guys bye bye bye